and welcome back. High school nearing an end for local seniors. It's been four years of irreplaceable memories with a lifetime of new ones ahead. And a local teacher wanted to give his seniors one last surprise before they graduated. KX24 Nightside anchor Aaron Luna tells us what it was. Aaron? Nadine, it's so easy for teachers to get attached to their students. And one Spanish teacher at Rogers High School had a special way of sending his seniors off to conquer the world while embarking on a new adventure himself. Summer break is knocking at Rogers High School's door. Freshmen, it's all about the memories, and I said for many of my friends. And Spanish teacher Jose Montesinos is helping students hold on for just a few more days. It's all about the memories, the moments. And he's about to add one more of those memories to the high school yearbook. Sophomores. And one big memory to his own story. Juniors. So, as he works the crowd, a special someone is watching from the front row, like most of the school, unaware of what's about to happen. All right, seniors. And what's written on that rolled up sign. I'm very proud of you, so I'm going to leave you with one more memory. Enter Melissa Chartre. This is my beautiful lady. If students thought their Spanish teacher was a bit excited for a simple assembly, here's why. If you didn't catch that, she said yes. Very nervous. I was very nervous to the point that I was, you know, wow. He told me he was going to be presented with an award today, and he would like me to be there. I got the big reward, absolutely. <laughs> oh, a lot of pressure. A lot of my colleagues are like, wow, well, why are you doing it in front of the kids? And, you know, I lost it. <laughs> a new beginning for seniors. And one senior. I uh, had no idea, no idea, but it was beautiful and wonderful. <laughs> and of course, some of the students knew what was happening, but most of the school was just as shocked as Jose's fiance. We want to wish them the best in their future. In the studio tonight, Aaron Luna, KXY4 News.